Greetings, fellow outsiders, and welcome back to Until Then. We are going to jump straight into the game today. I'm excited. I think this is going to be the last episode, so let's continue. Jake? Wait, it worked? The day started over? Things still look pretty bad, though. We... we did it, right? November 14th, it's Friday. Okay. Oop. Friday, but... This is still the same Friday? Hey! Son? Dad? The mayor's office is giving relief goods today. I ran as soon as I heard. I, I got some ration cards and this shirt too. <laughs> Funny, huh? Dad? Why did you- uh, why are you here? What are you talking about? From abroad? What, what happened? Why are you asking this? It's been almost a year now. Just tell me. Of course I had to come home after the earthquake. I couldn't- w Wait, this? This was the earthquake? Son, I know these are hard times, but I think you need to get some good rest. I know it's hard, losing your mom and this. I can't lose you two. We only have each other now. Oh, I almost forgot. Uh, Catherine left you some cookies while you were asleep. She asked if she could come over again later. They're raindrop shaped. It's pretty cute. <laughs> Can I, uh, you know, take one? <laughs> uh, I'll see you inside. Take it easy, son. Holy crap. No, no, it can't be. Th that was supposed to make things better. Well, if the realities are collapsing within each other, maybe the earthquakes are like the physical manifestation of that in the real world. So that's why they're getting worse, because they're um, like that. Okay, Nicole is texting us. Mark, it's looking bad. Did we do it right? Is there even a right way? Are you okay? Hey, are you okay? Yeah, though, um, what we did back there... Maybe a bit dizzy, but don't worry. I think I felt it too, yeah. So anyway, I thought I'd run to the subdivision. The houses look slightly different, but it's still mostly ruling evacuees living there. You remember how to set this experiment up? The double slit? Yeah. Check if there's still any fluctuations. Okay, good call. I'm on it. I'll ask around for materials. Louise, I better text her. Oh, yeah. Louise? Hey, Louise. Hey, Prez. Is there a book report or I'll be late today? Is there a book report? Sorry for asking, but is there a book report today? I really hope she's okay. Uh, hello, Louise? No? Shit, who else is gone this time? Asking the class chat probably won't hurt. Uh, Pearl? Okay. Hey guys, haha. Ryan, Edward, is there a book report? Is there a book report today? Kind of forgot. LMAO. That isn't funny, Mark. We can still dream about going back to school? Get a life, Mark. So school's been cancelled because of the ruling? He has it easy, guys. Chill. Lucky dude, uh, didn't get hit on the head. My god, you guys, I'm leaving. Uh, kind of miss school, though, lol. Man, what was that about? Kind of miss not starving, though? Gabriella left the group chat. Um, I don't- I'm- ugh, sorry. Sorry, what? Ugh! Emily left the group chat, too. Okay, sorry, I wanted to see if there was anything else. And Wilfred. Everybody's leaving. Sorry, what? Ugh, everyone's struggling, man. Yeah, I'm really sorry. Uh, life's been hard. I'm not making excuses, but... Ugh. Anyway, can I come over later? I asked Rydell, too, but he's really down these days. Come to think of it, maybe we should visit him. Kath, I think it's better you stay home. I'm sorry, you wouldn't understand, but it's for your own safety. Trust me. What the hell is wrong with you today? 
Uh, this is a good sign, right? Nicole said. Um, oh, okay, good call. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No wobbling or anything? It's totally still. And we did it, we're on the right path. But, Mark, everything's so much worse. You think this might be our doing? Louise isn't here again, so I'm afraid we don't know. We're racing against time here, what other choice do we have? I mean, like, what other choice do we have in this scenario? This is the only thing that seems to be doing anything. Uh, but it's doing bad things, it seems like. But, like, maybe in the very end it'll, like, end up fixing everything? Fixing the timeline? We'll see. It's our only hope, too. We have to act fast. These changes keep getting worse and worse every time we start over. Okay, so where do we meet next? Uh, we should go to the cliffside next since... It's the closest one from here. Please, no, I don't want... Can we... No, not now. Why not? It's where Cap... We should go to the farthest ones first, I think. But why? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, no. Uh, Mark, please. Please, Cap. Trust me. I don't know how this is gonna end. Whoa. Where are we? I figured. Hmm. Oh, we'd have less transportation options every time we start over. More roads will break. Provinces will become inaccessible. Nicole, we have to assume the worst case. You're right. It makes sense now. I'll meet you there then. Uh, you go first. I'll take care of something. I'm here. I might be right about the transportation part, but I can't help but feel like I'm just making an excuse. Okay, I brought just enough. We don't need a trip home anyway if we just start over after. I cannot wait to start over. Even before the quake, you know, I've always been planning to move. The capital's a dream. What is this? Oh, we're in line. I wonder if they know they've lived hundreds of lifetimes. Is it really just us? We don't even know if it's just our alternate selves or if it's actually us. I like to think it's actually us, that we did live through all that. It all felt real. But... But I... I don't want... Mark, your dad says you aren't answering his calls. Where are you? He said you looked down uh, this morning. Mark, please don't do this to us, to me. We'll reply. I'm fine, don't worry. Just here at the mayor's office. For the relief program thing. Oh, thank God. Why didn't you tell your dad then? Wait, are you there with him? Uh, yeah? Kath, please, I told you to stay. Mark, you're scaring me. What's going on? For real, what's wrong? Tell me. I'll fix this, Kath. I promise. Next. Feels like I've been here a couple of times, and yet almost nothing has changed. This is where Nicole had the scrapbook, I think. Where they kind of... We saw the, the disappearance for the first time. Do I have to go get the keys from the building, you think? Why's everything moving? Oh, he's going to here. Whoa! 3D! <laughs> there are the flowers.
Uh, I'm going in now. Okay, almost there. Right behind your bus. We almost saw each other back there. Yeah, lucky day. I'm here in the court, looking away. Mark. I've been thinking about it, but is it just me, or... Did this collapse feel harder since last time? It did feel harder at Jessica's. It used to be effortless, but back there we needed to focus. Mark, you think we can do it again? We can do this. We have to, right? What if we don't succeed? Hey, there she is. We haven't yet seen what happens if we fail, right? Uh, Nicole, we have to do it. You know we have to. I'm ready when you are. Mark, I know we have to do this, but I'll be lying to you if I didn't say I'm scared. I am too, but look, what other option do we have? We just let the day repeat again and again, making everything worse? Even if this doesn't do shit, we know we tried. I went to Kate. She's alive this time. I tried to apologize again, but of course to her I looked like a fool. That's why I'm scared, Mark. But if we don't fix this, she'll never forgive me. That even if she does somehow magically forgive me one day, the next day, it's either she's gone or we're back to where we started. I'm scared too. I really am. I, I don't want to see her die or go missing ever again. I won't let that happen. Oh. I... I remember everything now. Kath, Kath, oh my... I wish I did too. I wish I just remembered like you, but shit. I saw it with my own eyes all the time she... Sh hey. It's okay. I'm ready. Do I have to focus this time? How do I do this? Nicole! What if this doesn't- Wait! This is too much! Power through it! No, no, this is too much for me! Oh, do I have to keep going? I have to keep going. I don't know if I have to continuously click, or if I just stare. No! 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 Nicole! Nicole? Kate! Nicole! We have to keep it going! M Mark? What in the... I don't know what's happening, but I think we absolutely have to finish it! Look at me, now! Oh no! <gasps> this is for Kate, Nicole! It's getting worse. We, we did it? Oh no. Okay, calm down. It did actually work. No reason to panic now. Hello? Anyone? Mom? Are you there? Did you have fun today? Hey, it's Jake. Hey, Jake! Do I have to do something? Oh, I have to- uh, yeah! Yeah, I tried the piano! You really can't hear me. Nicole isn't a good teacher, though. <laughs> She's harsh sometimes, but in a good way, kinda. Well, that sounds like fun. Kate will be jealous of you. Her fault, she has frog doo do homework. And that's her fault. Hey, Dad, are, are we going home now? that? 
Are we gonna actually know what happened to Jake by the end of this? I've always kind of just assumed it was something related to the ruling and the multiple universes since other people had gone missing during this. Make it stop. Please, Lord, make it stop. Jake? Coming! You ready for the most epic prank yet? It's time to make bullies pay! You want to sneak out? Well, where? Duh, Nicole's. That got you, eh? Are you serious? T uh, you tell me now. You're the prankster here. Do I continue walking? They're gone. So these are memories, but of Jake's, not exclusively Nicole's. Ugh, I can't play this bar right. Ugh, this is hard. <laughs> no, no, stop. <laughs> hey, what's the matter? Uh, nothing. Just don't hurt the piano. Has feelings too, you know. Right. Sorry, Mr. Piano. I won't hurt you again. Now we're playing as Nicole. Zero four one two A. What's the flight code again? P one eleven three ones. You need a photocopy for this? I don't know. I'll ask Elsa. I'm done then. Anything else you need help with? You are way too fast at this. Tell me about it. You know, my job's very bureaucratic. Uh-huh. I think I need help with something, actually. Let me... Oh, amusement park. What's that? You need help with an amusement park? Shh. Is that a, the surprise? Yes, and there's a promo next week. We can't afford it, right? It's for our son. But have you asked if next week's... Mark, hun? By any chance, are you going out next week for maybe school group work or hanging out with friends or... I don't care, Mom. I have group work next week and any surprise you have for me doesn't change the fact that you're leaving. Well, we'll figure it out. Oh, man. Oh, no. At least we know we're trying, right? <laughs> hey, Kath. Ha ha ho, Mark. Kath, what, what are you doing here? I just, I didn't want to stay at home. Again. <laughs> I mean, everywhere else is pretty shitty, too. But hey, you're here, and uh, we can play. Kath, stop it. Uh, of course I won't stop beating your ass. You suck it. No, seriously? Stop it. Hey, uh, what's up? Something wrong? Listen, I... I've seen you. Many times in... In trouble. I don't know how to explain it, but... We're running out of time. I have to go. Heading out? Can I come? I don't think that's a good idea. Please, just... Please? I'll stay out of your way. I just want to get out of here for now.
Shit, how can I be so blind in so many realities? Please? But if I let her... She's coming with us. Sorry, Mark, she's coming with us. We'll protect her. No, it'll be over soon and everything will return to... Where are we headed? Kath, I can't. I promise I'll behave. I just want to tag along, please. No. You can't come, okay? Mark. <sighs> Sorry, Kath. I just don't want you near any trouble. Never. Mark, what's going on? Yesterday, you were just... I don't know. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm good. Just stay here, okay? But just stay here. So I'll be over soon. I, I promise. Huh? What is? Hey! Your cookies. She said yesterday he was acting weird too, but if he started the day over, does that mean that it's the next day? Mark, your dad and I are worried. Where are you? Please don't do this to us, Mark. Life is hard, but you know we have each other. I have to save her. And dad, and... Mom, can I talk to you just one more time? Sorry, folks, but it looks like the road ahead eroded and is too dangerous. I'm afraid we have to stop here. Where are we? Are we going back to the tree? Mood is so different. Has he even talked to Nicole? I'm really nervous. Can I go back at all? No. Are we going to Jake's house, actually? The thing... Would Louise have been here, though? Because even in the first universe, when there seemed to be way less damage, this was still a dangerous area. So would she have known to mark this on the map? It's almost as I remember it. They said the roads eroded. Guess we have no choice but to walk. Okay. Hey, I'm here. I'm near. Maybe 30 minutes out or I don't know. All right, where do we meet? Just at the entrance. I don't want to go to our house or anyone's. Uh, is anyone there? Wait.
Congratulations, Nicole. Is someone gonna be there? Corpus? Is that... Huh? Who's there? Wait. It's Kate? Hello? Oh. Hello? Just passing by. Something like that. Uh, yeah. You? I used to live here. Oh. Uh, I'm Mark? Orha? Kate. She doesn't recognize me. Guess we don't know each other without school. This is the last place I saw my mom and my brother. Sorry. I don't even know why I'm even here. He's gone. She's gone. I don't know where they went. And now everything's worse. I pushed his best friend away because she wouldn't let him go. I wanted her to move on so we could move on together. But look at me. I'm here, looking for him. I feel so fucking stupid. Hey, it's not stupid. And I'm telling my entire tragic backstory to some rando passing through. Mark! Uh, who's that? Uh, sorry, excuse me. It's nice meeting you. Oh, sure. It could be an opportunity. Where are you? Because Kate actually seems to want to reconcile with her this time. Mark! Are we going to call out? Mark! I'm going as fast as I can without running because there's not a run button. <laughs> Okay, it is Nicole. Hey. Where are you? I'm here. Mark! Is that you? Nicole, sorry, behind you. Don't turn around. Mark, didn't I tell you not to- Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. I got carried away. But I'm ready now. Are you ready? I prepared myself this time. Alright, keep your eyes open. And tell me if you start feeling anything. Let's just get this over with. Is she gonna see Kate, though, behind him or something? Oh god. Okay, we just stay focused. <gasps> yeah! She can't stay focused. Not with Kate. Oh, wait, but what does this mean? It, it's you again. Nicole, wait! Focus! Kate, I... What are you doing here? I'm just... I'm not here to get in your way. I... Did you follow me? No! No, I, I didn't. I, not everything is about you. And why are you here? Aren't you the one who told me not to go back? Yes, I know that, but... But what? Now you're the one who's looking back? What else are we gonna do in this fucked up world? What else could I distract my with myself with? You don't know what I'm going through. Oh no. Nicole! Please, this won't stop unless... We are all going through it, Nicole. We live every day with no hope for anything better. So what the hell are you saying? No, you don't know shit. You aren't going through realities. You see, I tried apologizing again and again. I wanted you to forgive me. Nicole? We're about to start over. Look at me now. Nicole, wait. I... I'm sorry. Kate. What does that mean, though, for the realities? Nicole? We have to keep going! Nicole!
Well, hello there, sleepyhead. We have a relief program to catch, so you better get your ass up. Path? What are you doing here so early in the... What the... Where is this? Duh? Downstairs? Huh? No, I mean... Wait. Isn't there a relief program at the mayor's office? Mayor's office? What are you saying? Tisk tisk. All your postmates are up and you're the only one left here. Postmates? Ah, I see. No problem. I'll get you a bucket of water. Once you wash your face, you'll be back in no time. Where am I? What do we do now? Has it just gotten so bad that uh, he doesn't have a home anymore? Eight diamond? That was my class. Wait, is this his school? Wait, that's my parents' bed. And that one's mine. What the hell? Buckets? What for? And there's the eight diamond again. What is this? The damage? I don't know what these are. Ration cards? And Dad's ID? Is he here again? Canned goods? Candles? It's way too many for... This isn't looking good now. Where do I go? Can I not leave? Wait, could I not leave? I thought I went all the way over to the right. Kath? Kath? Little help here! Uh, okay, suit yourself. Kath, where are we? Hmm, I can't tell if you're pulling my leg or you're still half asleep. No, really. <sighs> Just go wash your face. I'll see you down there. Raydell said the line's getting crazy. So, yeah, you know the drill. And thanks for the water! Nicole, at least, well, at least we still can contact her. Nicole, how are things looking there? Mine's not good. Where are you? No. What? Nicole, hey! Don't tell me. No way. There's no way. I'm offline. Oh, I can- <laughs> No, not in this moment. Not the little dinosaur thing. Okay, maybe let's try and reload. Okay, we don't need to be playing the dinosaur game. <laughs> if that's the case, though... Bro, is the laundry open today? Nah, bro, good luck. You smell. Then does that mean- Wait. If that really was the way to save everyone. Shit, this really is our school. Is there anything over to the left? No. Oh no. We go down? I guess we can go down. For the posters this time. The call for donations is here. New cooperative business idea. Want to help our people? Find out the office for secretary at the second floor. Look for Rex Silverio. This isn't really just a school anymore. Curfew 8 p.m. to 6 a.m. Exception made for pass holders approved by the president. The president of what? the school? PSA, stay indoors at all times. Trust your comrades. Together we are united. PSA, your ration card is just a piece of paper. Use it responsibly. Batteries now in stock on the third floor. Limited stock. I guess power grids are down here. Wanted power pump operator. Must have experience with hand tools. Must have graduated high school pre-ruling. 
Do not promote fear mongering, religious or otherwise. Have we passed, like, a point of no return with this? She's here, isn't she? Mark? Hey. I've been looking for you. Uh, yeah. Me too. Kathy and I saved you a spot down the line. Follow me. Wait, Raydell? Yeah? Where's, uh, your camera? Shut up. Don't make it worse. No one knows who stole it. Do you? So, hey, do you want your goods or what? Uh, yeah, I'll follow. I just have to, uh, is there a Nicole Laxamana here? A who? Never mind. But do you happen to know where, uh, Louise is? If she's the Ordunias? Ugh, really? Yeah. Top floor. What do you ask? Nothing, I just, we can't ask for any more favors from them, Mark. Besides, no one listens to their crazy made-up shit. Don't get any big ideas. Okay, if that's what you want. Hey, did you find it? You're right. Something's up with him today. Mom, is that you? Okay. Hey, Louise. Do you have any new reports from the Manzanera's best? Louise, you're here. Oh, Mark, it's been some time. Yeah, it has been. Yeah. This place is no different to a city, isn't it? We're just floors away, but it feels like an entire block's away. Yeah, I guess. You always... Uh, you know you're always welcome here. What'd you visit just now? I, uh... Sorry if... You know, it's scary for us to go down these days. We have good intentions, I promise. So, uh, what brings you here? I am here to... I'm sorry, Louise. Sorry? I used you. We used you. What are you? In another reality, you made me realize how much of our time together was just kind of nothing. And I didn't even see that until you told me. I know it sounds crazy, but we've met in many other realities. You're almost like a different person from one to the next. Yeah? I remember almost everything from every reality now, and yeah, I... Mark, it does sound crazy. Okay, how about this? I'll pretend you're saying the truth. How different am I now? Uh, an entirely new person. I wonder what changed you this time. Okay. And say, when did you enter this reality? What does it matter? You're not gonna... Oh, come on. I'm serious, if you are. Let's say, uh, an hour ago. Do you have any memories from yesterday in this reality? No, it doesn't work like that. It's... You even know where you are? That's the thing. I don't know. Do you want to know? It's okay. I'll figure it out myself, for once. If you don't want to know where you are, I think you should at least know something. That is, if you're serious. It's fine, really. You don't have to. The ruling? We saw warning signs of it weeks before it struck. It was too strong to ignore. The fluctuations, the small earthquakes, the memory mix-ups, the disappearances... It's like the universe was rewriting its rules mid-operation. So I did make it worse. Great. No one knew what was going to happen when it reached its peak, so everyone anticipated the worst. That the universe would tear itself apart, burst at the seams, and we would be none the wiser. But the exact opposite happened? Yes. A lot of people died. But before it struck, some good things happened. Of course you can say that. You're up here living... No, I don't mean it that way. I'm not... Look, your dad came home. You told me Catherine and her brother are closer than ever. And I... I'm closer to my family than before. 
I... I talked to them. That's... that's good. And you, you and I are good friends. Or at least, until recently. Look, I know people have suffered and are suffering, but Mark, we can put a stop to this. Progress has been going well, and... We can start generating electricity again? At scale, with the materials we can obtain. And best of all, it's clean. I... I guess that's cool. If only they'd hear us out and give us what we need so we can... Louise, I, I'm sorry, but thank you for everything you've done. For everything you're doing now to this... this community. Oh. God does not play dice. What? Einstein. That's what he said to quantum mechanics. God does not play dice. What... what does that mean? He couldn't accept that our foundation of our world is non-deterministic. But look, we've been getting along just fine, right? Whatever gets thrown at us. At random. Whenever. And somehow, still, we're all right. What is this? A curfew pass? I believe you. You might need it more than I do. Louise. Uh, Mark! Why'd you go up there? Uh, am I not supposed to? God, you really are out of your mind today. Yep. Hey, sorry, Mark, about, you know, a case of bad morning. It's okay, man. We're good. Well, good thing is your dad came back and got you your goods, but ugh, man. Why'd you let your dad do that? He looked tired. My dad would never do that for me. Uh, oh? But my brother probably would. I still wouldn't make him, though. But hey, lead the way. Oh, but hey, by the way, <laughs> we got flour this month. You guys want some cookies? Andrew and I are making some. Wow, flour. Count me in, then. Uh, sh sure. All right, see you around, man. And weirdo. Ah, weirdo. It's more sleep, okay? Haha, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I will. Ugh. Things did get worse, but also... Ugh. I don't know if I should still... No, she must be waiting for me there. I can't not show up. So are we going back to the... cliffside? Is that what's happening? I see what Mark means, though, and what Louise said, where things, like, monumentally got worse... Uh, in the world. Hey. Uh, son? Hey, Dad. Where were you? Uh, just wandering. Did you ask for some batteries? Uh, yeah, I'll get them here later. Can we talk, or... Is that the picture? Of the family? Dad? Uh, where's mom? Mark? Your mom? Your mom is gone. You know that, right? I... yeah. I do. I won't deny it or hide my past. You know, I used to think she was still out there. Yeah. But when the quake started and smart people warned us, I knew I had to slap myself. Maybe a couple of times. It hurt, but it also felt good. I would never leave my loved ones alone. Ever again. And I... I would never leave you alone. I think he might have been talking about Nicole since he was looking at his phone. There's the speed limit. It's glitching though. One last hot spot, 
hot spot, the last place, the last one, it'll be over, right? She's here, Nicole. She must be, she knows the plan. Nicole, Nicole, please be here. You must be, I trust you. It'll be over soon. It'll be over just... Nicole, please. Where are you? Mark? Nicole? Mark, what are you doing out here? I was about to give you cookies when I saw you sneaking out. No, no, no. How'd you get out anyway? Do you have a pass? What are, uh, why are you on the ground? No, Kath, don't move. Just stay there. What? Man, I thought I'd lost track of you. I'm going to save you. No matter what it takes. I, I can't let this happen again. What was that? I won't. I... Hold on, let me... N no, fire! We might... Just a small one, okay? Whoa! 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 Mark, really, what is going on? I, I don't know any more, Cap. Look, we can still get back to the center. We just have to be careful. We cannot be this close to a hotspot. You know about the hotspots? Huh? You've been really, ugh. Look, I know it's been really scary these days. Let's just stay calm and think of something. Did we jump realities again? This shit is getting more and more unpredictable. Maybe if we take the highway, it'll be faster. Wait, no. There's a hot spot there. Come on, come on. There must be some... I, I can't keep watching you die. What? I'm gonna stop it, okay? I won't, I won't let you go. Mark, I'm still here, aren't I? It feels like it's my fault. All of this. Mark, how could this possibly be your fault? I don't know how to save you. Why are you saving me? You're my best friend. And maybe I wasn't a good friend. Maybe if I paid more attention, none of this would have happened. Mark? If I could just go back one more time, maybe it'll... Mark? I, I have to. Mark? What if it's not up to you? No, 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 not again. Mark, you're my best friend too. I... Cap? Cap! Come on, take me to the next one. Come on. What? No. No, that's not what's supposed to... No. No, no, no. No! No, please. What?
Nicole. Mark. Kate. I'm sorry. I really am. I, I keep messing things up. I can't do anything right. N not even once. Don't say that. What? I mean it. They said I'll never be an engineer. And they were right. Mark? Mark! But look at what you're doing. You're making a robot. <laughs> it's this again? Not really. This is just a... <clears throat> oh, what I mean is, yeah, this is a robot. So why don't you go make robots for a living? <laughs> I wish, son. But I'm not quite qualified for that. You seem pretty qualified for me. Mark, what do you want to be? I don't want anything now. I just want... Nicole? Am I following her? Jake? Jake! Come on, you need to learn your scales! Hey. Hey! Something wrong? Nah, don't worry about it. So what are we waiting for? Nicole, how do you do it? Dexterity, of course. No, I mean... I... Hey, now. You know what'll get you up? My mom bought me a whoopee cushion. A bigger one. <laughs> you think of what I'm thinking? <laughs> I'm thinking... Maybe a doctor? That's good. He'll treat people and make them happy. Or maybe a pilot. Uh, yeah, you'll take us places, won't you? <laughs> yeah. We'll go to a chocolate hills and eat one entire hill and then... Then our last stop would be Mount Olympus and meet Zeus. Mark, whatever you want to be. Engineer, doctor, pilot... We'll make it happen, all right? What about you, Mom? What do you want to be? Well, your mom didn't really have a choice. And like your dad, it's too late. But you, you have a choice. You have a chance. Hmm, but if you did have the chance, what did you want to be? A musician. That's what I've always wanted to be. Really? When I have work, I watch recitals and competitions nearby. A recital? They perform. Kids, adults, piano, guitar, flute. It's an item music. <laughs> that sounds fun. Can I go with you? You know my work, it's far. You always say that, Mom. But maybe one time. You can tag along. You promise? I promise. with Jake and Nicole practicing. Ugh, I swear. This is freaking hard, I swear. Tell me about it. I don't think I can do this. Hey now. Things are hard for a reason, you know. Remember what I told you? You just have to find that spark. Exactly. But I just really want first place this time. <laughs> Second place sucks. <laughs> Tell me about it, Nicole. No, it doesn't. <laughs> You're not helping. <laughs> if only there was a scales competition. I'd be last place, huh? Boo-hoo. <laughs> what about your own piece? It's not limited to just classical, right? They suck. They all suck. Then I'll try. Hi! I'm the very talented pianist, Nicole Laxamana. And I make my own music. No, my ears! 
<laughs> so Mark must have seen her recital in that flashback at one point because his mom took him. Wait, what? That part, can you repeat that? Ah, uh, that? No, after that. Is she coming up with the, the composition she played with Mark? Ooh. Scoot! <laughs> Again. something. Jake? You're a genius! Ah, uh, you're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, Dad. Uh, he's a little flimsy. But as long as you take good care of him, he'll be fine. Got that? Yep. Your mom's off to work now. Aww. She barely even saw, uh, Tornelio dance. I'll be back, don't worry. Then we'll have all the time to dance with him. Yes! Bye, Mom! Take care! You guys have fun! Maria? Keep Mark with his robot. Did I forget something? Have you decided? I haven't. Whether you have decided or not, don't you think we should at least tell him? But, Maria, we can't keep doing this. We know what he's like. I know, but I just I haven't decided yet. I have decided. If you work abroad or not, it's fine. It's your call. But your son, he doesn't know anything, and I worry that... Are we on time? Rent? Yeah. So it won't happen. Not anytime soon. It's not just this month's rent. What about the next one? What about... What about you? What if you go? Oh, for Christ's sake, you know I can't. I don't have the... Then I'll decide when it's time. Maria, please, this isn't right. Just think about it. Please? I... I'll call you. Hey, we're back here. Jake? Don't listen to your mom. She's the one at fault here. She just hasn't realized it yet. That, that's what mom said, too. Tsk. Please just tell me things will be better. It will. We'll sort this out like we always do. But this time, I, I don't know. It feels different. Yeah, but... Mom, she told me she... She told you what? She told me not to. She wants to leave? With you? I... I... Y yeah. Fuck. Dad, no, please. No, no. I made things worse. I made it worse. I, I made it worse. I made it worse. I made things worse. Worse. It's not your fault. It's not. Really, don't worry. Yeah? There's one next week? Okay, you have fun. Love you. What about next week? Oh, it's nothing. Just your mom's hobby of watching recitals and whatnot. Oh. Anyway, she's coming home the week after. She asked if you want anything? Hmm. I... no. Nothing. Hey, son. Yeah? You'll always love your mom no matter what, right? Uh, of course. You and mom. We're together, always. How did I 
do? Hello? Jake? Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, you did great. Much better than last time. Hmm. Have you really been listening? You've been out of it lately. Yeah, I am. I am listen l uh, listening, I mean. I am, but I can't help but... Oh, no. Did I play something wrong? No, it's not that. My timing was off, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, no. So it was off. Wait, wait. My mom and I were going on a short trip just for a few days. Uh, I'm going to your show. I'll make... We'll make it. Don't worry. Phew. Don't scare me like that. <laughs> yeah, just a short trip. Then no problem. Let's keep practicing. Oh, no. But I... There might be a chance that, uh... I will make it. <laughs> Is your child playing? Oh, hey! I I'm just watching. <laughs> what about you? My boy's playing the flute. That's exciting. Good luck to you! Up next, a talented young pianist from Pegasa, playing one of the classics. Give it up for Nicole Laxamana. We saw this memory. Hi, everyone. I, I've i decided to play an original composition instead, if that's all right. The piece. Hold on. Did mom say she was... M mom? <gasps> she composed this? Apparently. It's beautiful. Mom, can you hear me? Jake, if only you could hear me. She really was there. No, no. Y you can't do this. I'm sorry, Mark. Mom, no. Please stay. I, I won't complain when you have a month-long job anymore. Just please. Stay here. I'm not going away. No, it's, it's not like that. I'll still be coming home. But I promise. But what about your other promises? I I'm still keeping... And didn't you say we have all the time? We do. I'll still come back. I'm not leaving you or your dad. But why didn't you tell me? Like, I wasn't part of this? This family? But why'd you and dad keep it from me? All these years? Please, son. I need you to understand. What? Your dad and I, we never achieved our dreams, remember? But you, whatever your dream is, whatever you want to be, I want you to have the chance at that. I want a better life for you. Better than the one we have now. Your mom's right, son. We just want you to have choices, more freedom. But, I mean, aren't there other options? There has to be without leaving us. No, Mark. Again, I'm not leaving you, or... There isn't. It's the only way. I mean, look at your relatives. They're... But not all of them got a better life. No, but... The offer I got is much better, and, and... Just give them some time. They'll come around. I know. I don't know, okay? They're just gone. He's your brother. Y you should know. And he's your best friend. Don't you know? N no, what? Really? Not even... Ugh, you didn't even try to get to know my brother. I- I did! Of course I did. Yeah, sure. What do you know? Do you even care? You're not even worried. Shut up. Just shut up. 
We all saw this coming from a mile away. But why didn't he... Why didn't he tell you? Beats me. Maybe you weren't listening. Congrats on the first place, Nick. Please, give my family some space. We will keep searching. <laughs> Whoop! Got it! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Dad. It's not much, but I think you'll like it. Thanks, son. Sorry, I don't have a present for you this year. Oh, it's no biggie. You're the man. Mark, I don't have a present, but... <laughs> Here. It's from your mom. I mean, look at the size of that thing. Mark? Won't you ever forgive her? It's been years. Yeah? Years since she's been gone. Wait, so... His father is not gone. He's there for Christmases. Was there a reality where he didn't leave? Is that the real... Timeline? Is what we're seeing... The truth? Years since he's been gone, huh? He and his mom... Right. So, what do you think? I don't know, miss. I'm not really in the business of dealing with minors. Please, I need to find him. I'll find a way to make the money. I understand, kid, but I can't accept this. Tell you what, come back with your mom or dad or something, and I'll look into it for you. Good luck, kid. You know where to find me. Son, I'm off to work. Did the mailman arrive? No, no one came. Take care. Uh, okay. See you later. Oh, do I have to move Nicole? Oh, I do. Okay. We're we going over in this direction. I think Mark was talking in this direction. What the hell? Please, I'm telling you. Just stop, okay? But we're helping you. No! You are not helping. You and your parents. Hey! You just don't really care, do you? Look at our resident nerd. He's gonna leave us behind one day. Yeah, you guys are going to be working for me one day. Oh, God. We need to study Rydell. We can't let that nightmare come true. <laughs> Mark. She said congrats. Mark, she... Do I look like I care? I care. And fuck, I care about you. Look at yourself. Look at what happened to you. I know you're hurt, son. And you're hurt, and... Dad, stop, please. What are you saying? You care about me? Nick, this isn't you. Sure, she never came home like she promised. But do you want our family to be like... Like this forever? If she can keep a promise, sure, let's turn it around. You're much more than this. You're not just a person who knew Jake. You... you are Nicole. Mark. Take those words back. Now. What are you getting at? Just get to the point. I mean it. She's never coming home. I don't want our family to be broken. Take them back. Now. Broken? 
I'm sorry, but that's really how I feel, Dad. I feel... Abandoned. Betrayed. That's how we felt. And there's nothing you can do to change that. But you can. You can. You just have to... Forgive. Yourself. Please consider it. Nicole. Oh, Mark. we done? I... I'm still here? Why am I still here? Nicole? Are you here? Jake? Hello? Is anyone here? I... I failed. Is this our doing? Is this my fault? I'm sorry, please. I know what I've done and I take it all back. Everything. I'm sorry. Mom, Dad, Jake, Kate, please. I... I'm sorry. Whoa. Hello? That was the picture Nicole was painting earlier? Wait, I hear something. <gasps> Wait, are they okay? Hello? This is beautiful. Strange. But beautiful. Anyone? Mark? Jake? Oh, do I have to- I have to walk with her. <laughs> Wait, are they gonna- <gasps> That's odd. Are they gonna play the piece? Maybe? Is she- Wait. Is she on a different- the trees are like 2D weird. I thought she, maybe she was on a different plane. Wait! Is she on a different plane? Like, that's the thing? You're pristine. Let's see. Mom, is that. You wanted me to play with you? But what do you want me to. Scales? Is that you, Jake? Mm -hmm. 
Nothing? Okay. How about one of your favorites? Oh, you want me to? Well then, if that's what you want to hear... Mom? Nicole? <laughs> Whoa, when did you learn to play like that? With you? <laughs> Unless... <laughs> no way. That's really... Okay, then. Oh, God, I'm playing. Oh, sorry. I didn't know. <laughs> Okay, now you're gonna stress me out. I really like this song. <laughs> it's so calming with the water in the back too. Oh. A little less calm, because I'm stressed out with this. Hold on. Okay, no talking. We're just gonna listen to music, and I can focus. You're crazy. <laughs> Still not as good as me. So... <laughs> what are you doing? Is he gonna throw something at her? Hello? No, they're throwing abstract uh, ideas at each other. Everything in the universe is described by waves. These ripples give rise to the existence of particles that make up everything. These particles, they meet and they collide. And when they do, they interact. But when these ripples are so strong and they collide, they cause a tsunami. And something bad, something bad happens. 
No. We're just gonna mess it all up again. I... I don't know what to do anymore. Wait. You did your best. But look, everything's messed up. And it feels like it's my fault. No matter what I did, even if I did things differently, nothing changed. It just kept getting worse. You can't blame yourself. All you ever wanted was to help. To fix things. To understand. But nothing worked. I couldn't... I couldn't get through. I just wanted to understand why you left. I... I should have listened more. I should have... It's okay. It's okay. You did your best. The fact that you wanted to understand. The fact that you kept trying. You should be proud. You can only see the world through your own eyes. Hear it through your ears. No one else's. Still, you persevered. You put your heart on the line. Over. And over. And over again. I wish I could fix it. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could hug you one more time. Tell you I love you and I'm sorry. That's all. That's really all I want. It's not your fault. If I had just paid better attention, if I had asked if you were okay, you can't punish yourself. If anything, I blame myself. What? I should have told you. I should have trusted you. I wanted... I wanted to fix things, too. But what are you saying? I'm so sorry. I never meant to hurt him. I never meant to hurt my son. I just wanted a better, better life for him. <laughs> I wanted to change things. I wish I had just told her the truth. I wish I never hid it from her. J Jake? She's my best friend, Mark. I just wanted her to hear me. <laughs> to understand. You were both so young. I know that now. <laughs> I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I just wanted to see my son smile again. To let him know it's okay to stop punishing himself. He never really hated you, you know. He just didn't want you to leave. I know. But all I wanted was to give him a better life. A life with no regrets. Unlike mine. All this. All the timelines. The lifetimes you've lived. Was never my intention. Lifetimes? They were all real, weren't they? They were. Mark's life is finally better. He has a better home. A better school, better options, but he's more alone than ever. After all these lifetimes, I, I remember them all. How many? I've lost count. Hundreds, probably. 
And after that, it was chaos. We lost control, and, uh... And, yeah, <laughs> this. So much has changed. Nicole's family, her friends, her interests. But in every timeline, some things remain the same. In every one of them, she's still looking for me. I have so many regrets. I never wanted this, this collapse. It seemed like I had the power to change the course of his life, but in the end, I realized what I've been doing wrong. I just, I want her to live her life, to let go, to learn. Jake, it's okay, I think. I think he understands. I should have trusted that he would. No more going back. No more. There's only one way forward. And it's in front of you. Nicole, thank you. Thank you for looking out for my son. For what it's worth, Miss Borja, he's a wonderful young man. I know. I'm so proud. It's on you now. Thank you for helping Nicole get to where she is now. I won't let you down. You know what to do now. to do now. Let Let Go so bad for my mom for Kathy for you I know I I wanted the same too <laughs> look where that got us you know you don't even have to say sorry you did your best you did too much So did your mom. I know. We all did. We all do. So... No more going back now. Do you think we'll see each other again? We do. Oh, Mark. What if it makes things worse? <laughs> All I know is I don't ever want to forget you. Me too. 
want to thank you, Mark. For the end of the world. <laughs> for... For the cheesy hard cookies. For when aliens abducted you. <laughs> and when you believed in me. Every time you you crashed into me, for all of it, a hundred lifetimes, huh? And we lived all of it. We really did. So I guess that's why. It always felt like I knew you. <laughs> yeah. Always. I guess... This is goodbye? Does it have to be? I guess so. Bye, Nicole. Goodbye, Mark. You know the rest. I think I do. Well, the timer is going back. That's too fast. She was missing that night. We looked everywhere, searched everywhere, shouted her name everywhere. Yet not a single trace of her. Not even a trail. Not even a shadow. Not even a ghost. It's been a long time since it rained like this. Oh, I love the touch of raindrops sliding down my face. I never knew what she meant by that. But I'm content the night sky was showering rain for her. The heavy rain tells me you are there. But at the same time, you are nowhere. A million cries and hours have passed. I finally surrendered at last. I ran as far as I could, like she told me I should, until eventually. I found myself missing. Within me, I looked everywhere, searched everywhere, shouted my name everywhere. Yet not a single trace of me. It felt like the world had ended. But a part of me wants to believe that the world hasn't ended. Yet. Ugh, I have to save her. <laughs> Wait, we're back. Okay, we're back. It's not the end. It's not the end yet. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I wish it was raining on me right now so that you could see my face. <laughs> it's Rydell. <laughs> Rydell. 
Mark, finally! <laughs> we'll find her. I know we will. Let's keep going. Okay, I'm assuming it's not prom night anymore. And I'm assuming we're <laughs> looking for Kathy. for you. I, I... I was just, you know... <laughs> hey, Mark! <laughs> Twinsies! Kev, I... I want you... Sorry. I want you here. We want you here. I have no idea what's going on in that mind of yours, but I want to understand. Marks, stop it. You're making me... I don't know why, but I want to understand. As best I can. We'll hurt. Be hurt. We'll struggle. We'll fail. But as long as we're here and we're trying, we... We'll be fine. We're here, Cap. We're here for you. family moment, huh? <laughs> uh, yeah. Let's... Let's talk. Hey, we're playing as Nicole? Oh, am I not playing? Whoa. This is beautiful. Kate! Considering it. <laughs> no matter how much we want to. We'll never truly understand someone else. Not entirely. Understanding, isn't it? To misunderstand. To ride. To struggle. Still, somehow. <laughs> Our desire to understand. <laughs> to connect, to belong. To forgive. <laughs> to grieve, to accept. gotten us farther than we once thought. <laughs> we place trust in ourselves, in each other.
And in the end, despite everything, <laughs> we keep trying. We play along. Wait. Was that Cap and Mark and Rydell? We get along just fine. hasn't ended yet. <laughs> Sorry. We get to see a future with Cap. Looking fancy today, huh? I've got a date. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> you look nerdy, Mark. Uh... I'm wounded, Mark. Gobsmacked. You've been talking to someone? How could you keep such a juicy piece of information from me? <laughs> Calm down. It's only the first date. <laughs> You're so lovestruck. You know, you still have to get me a dress for Rydell's premiere, right? Oh, Kath, I already did. And you'll love it. So that was how many dates again? Four. And it went to nothing? Haha, uh -huh, yeah, that sucked, but... I've got a good feeling about this one. Oh ho ho! Now that's confidence! Hey, wait! No, that's not- no! Nicole is right there! <laughs> wait, don't tell me they're gonna- are they gonna crash into each other? Are they actually going to meet? Because if the ruling never happened, aww. gonna get to know are we <laughs> no <laughs> wow uh i got an achievement at the end there that said accept and let go which i'm assuming the butterflies there were showing that they were not going to interfere with whatever mark and nicole's path might be in the future but it's left us with a little bit of hope that maybe they'll meet each other again. But even if they didn't, they lived a hundred lifetimes together. Sorry, this game, wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. I would say overall it was a happy ending though. <laughs> Just a lot to take in, a lot of emotions, a lot about life in general. Oh man. And grief is a motherfucker. Uh, I think this game was a lot. Um, well, I think this game was about life. I was going to say, I think this game is about grief between Mark and Nicole uh, being able to let go of their past. Um, but wow. I brought tissues this time. <laughs> I have tissues. Um, I don't know if I can say enough 
about this game and really just how beautiful it was of an experience uh, in terms of narrative storytelling. It felt so beautiful at so many points and real. I mean, the writing was just really, really well done. Um, and I didn't know how it was going to end at all. And I'm, ha I'm happy. I'm also, I can't say I'm disappointed that he didn't end up with Nicole in the, like that we saw it, which I'm still, I'm talking through the credits. So maybe we'll get an end credit scene. Cause sometimes they'll do that. But I feel like that's also, um, that's also kind of life. I mean, with the achievement saying accept and let go, I feel like sometimes you might want something really bad, like very badly in life, but sometimes it's just not meant to be. And so the not knowing for us <laughs> as the omniscient player might be a little bit frustrating, but I feel like, I feel like that's life. Oh man. I'm so happy about Kath. I'm so happy Kath was okay. And that entire ending. And the butterflies. I'd be really interested because um, I feel like they're... I want to know, go back and play this game almost from the beginning. Because we started getting some of the memory anomalies from the very start. But then, obviously, I think the ruling in general was the event that started all of this, which it seemed like to me it was both Jake and um, Mark's mom that were kind of changing things uh, at that time from, like, beyond, from another dimension or whatnot. Uh, so I don't even think the ruling happened at the very end, which is why initially I was like, oh, Nicole should be there with all of them. But with the dates, it's because if that never happened, then she never had to move away from her hometown. Um, so that's why they would have never met during school. Even if they had some sort of internal feeling uh, that they've known each other for a long time beforehand. So... Um, yeah, that was really, really good. I don't know that I've played a game that's made me sob that much, <laughs> at least not in a, not in a while. Um, not to mention, I just, I'm looking at the credits too, the music and the composition and, uh, the use of that one song. God, it was so well done. I don't even think I can say enough good about this. This was a beautiful, it was a beautiful experience. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, thank you for making the game. Thank you for making me uh, fry my pants off. <laughs> um, I really want to know if there's like an after credit scene or if we're just going to start. Is it going to close the game? So there's a continue button again, but it's different. Can I continue? You're scaring me. Is it just going to start me from the end scene? No, we're just going to do the credits. And we have the music playing. Okay. Well, I guess that's it. That's it? We have all of the chapters. It's still glitching. Oh, goodness gracious. Well, that was an experience. <laughs> Yeah, this is a game that's going to stick with me for a long time. <laughs> it really is. It was just, I just, it was just so well done. I think part of the thing that really hits me with this game too is a lot of the stuff towards the end. It's uh, stuff that I believe and have found to be true in the sense that sometimes it's just about, most times in life, it's just about trying. It's about trying in relationships. It's about understanding that um, 
you're not going to be able to get to know everybody or see all of the pieces of them. I definitely feel like this is a game that you can look at through multiple lenses. I think an obvious one is about grief and letting go of the past. Uh, but I also find it interesting, the idea of making mistakes and trying to live or have kind of a perfect life or perfect timeline, which is just unrealistic as much as you would like nothing bad to happen in someone's life. Things happen and people make mistakes. And as far as I know, in this timeline, there's there's no other option. <laughs> you can't jump when something bad happens. You can just face it. And I think that's important, uh, especially as you gain more experiences growing up. You just understand that it's not easy and uh, everybody has something going on. I think I'm going to leave this series here. I absolutely adore this game and it's going to be one that sticks with me for a long time and I'm going to process it because I don't think I have all of the words to eloquently state exactly what this has meant to me, but I hope that it's meant something to you and I really hope that you enjoyed this playthrough as well. I will say whether or not this is our first lifetime or our hundredth lifetime. And no matter what you're going through in life right now, I don't have any words that I can say that I think will make it better, but I hope that you keep on trying and I will keep on trying too. But on that note, I'm gonna say farewell friends. Thank you so much for being here. Remember, we're not alone out there and I will see you guys in I don't want to say the next life. That sounds morbid. <laughs> that sounds like it's implying something. I'll see you guys in the next timeline. How does that sound? <laughs> so, until then, bye bye Mwah! See you guys in the next one. I gotta get tissues and uh, ibuprofen whenever I play emotional games, because I always end up crying so hard I give myself a headache. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.